Hi, everybody. Deborah Morris here. Chuck and I have been asked quite a bit what is going on with the housing market. So since the market pulse just came out uh, by the Orlando Regional Realtor Association, I figured I'd show you a couple of charts and then that way you can reach out to us and we can share a little bit more if you're interested. So let me share the screen here. I will show you um, lately what is going on here. So if you all can see that state of the market, and this is going to cover the central Florida area, a little bit part of the East Coast, um, north of Daytona, as well as part of the Tampa area down there to Sarasota. So again, we have our inventory. You can see year over year, last year it was 5450, this year over 10,000 um, properties in our inventory. That's double. Now, if you compare month over month, you're looking at about a 5% increase in percentages from the 10,282 to 10,796. So yes, there is a little bit more every month going on the market. Uh, new listings, you can see year over year went up 11.9% from 37 03 to 4143, but month over month, it dropped a little bit. So we have, it is weird. You have more inventory, yet the brand new listings have dropped. Hmm, where could that be coming from? Come but give us a call and we can share with you where that's coming from. New contracts, of course, uh, year over year went down about a half a percentage, and month over month went down about 3%. Uh, total pendings again, um, about a half a percentage year over year, and a little over, a little down, down by a little about eight and point three percent on total pendings. So we're getting less or going under contract. Are you noticing that? So I'll tell you a couple of keys. Well, actually, give me a call and I'll share with you a couple of the reasons why we notice that the pendings are going down. How's that? Closed sales, you're going down about 16%. Um, last year was 31.24. This year, 26.01. We could probably guess why there aren't as many closed. Um, interest rates have gone up this year, remember? Uh, so, But month over month, they were down about 10%. Again, why is that? Give us a call and I'll share with you about that. Um, I like to look at the median prices versus the average. The median price year over year is up about 2.6% from 385 to 395. So the values are still going up in Central Florida. Supply and demand people. Um, now month over month is still going up about 2.6%. So it may not be a major improvement, but uh, as far as uh, the prices, the median price that is, so in other words, we're getting rid of the outliers, all right? But it is still going up. So I wanna make sure you all know that. Um, average days on the market uh, from 41 to 54, a little bit increase. There's a couple of variables behind the reasoning for that. And look at that, month over month, it st stayed at the 54 days on the market. So you want it, your house to sell a little bit quicker than 54, give us a call and we'll tell you a couple of tips that we have noticed helps to improve that time frame. And again, the ones that are longer, of course, we can discuss that as well. Um, and then months of supply, 1.74 months from a year ago up to 4.15 months. Do you know what difference between supply uh, sellers and the buyers market is? Um, again, if we end up keeping everything selling at the same rate it is right now and nothing else changes as far as the amount of inventory and it's the same rate, how long will that inventory last? Um, the, of course, the balance market is more between the five, six or four, five and six months of inventory um, lower than the four months. That is definitely a seller's market, meaning that there aren't very many listings out there and there's a lot of buyers. Now, of course, you're getting a little bit more buyers on the market. 
and listing so it's more balanced. As you can see, May uh, uh, was 3.53 months of inventory and June is 4.15, an increase of 17.4%. So again, I'm throwing a lot of information out at you. I want you to know that Chuck and I are always here. If you have any questions, you're thinking about buying, selling, or investing sometime in the near future, you don't have a crystal ball. We don't know what's going to happen at the end of this year, but we do know what's going on right now. So let's sit down over in Zoom or uh, in person, and then we can discuss what your plans are, what your dreams are, and then we can take it from there. 321-348-0014. You have a great day. Bye-bye.